Hi guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel and this is another quick video tutorial on how to upload your files to Google Drive through a shared link using your smartphone or your tablet. So let's start! Hello once again, I'm Sir Angela Rafael and welcome to my video tutorial. In this quick video tutorial, you will learn how to upload your files to your Google Drive through a shared link using only a smartphone or a tablet. So, let's start. The first thing that you need to do is to open the shared link or I suggest that you copy the link and paste it on your preferred web browser. Now, on your Android devices, usually we use Google Chrome. And for iPhones, we use Safari. Now, after copying the link, just go to your web browser and paste it on the address bar, just like what is shown on the slide. On the top right of your web browser, press the three dots menu or also known as the hamburger menu and select and activate the desktop site. This will allow you to access the new button allowing you to upload your files and folders. Now that's the three dots menu located on the top right corner or portion of your web browser. Press that and the following menu will appear. On this next step, you will see the desktop site option. Press or click that and then you will be able to access the desktop site of Google Drive. Now, after clicking or pressing the desktop site option, this is how it will look like on your smartphones and tablets. Now, it's time to upload your files. You will now press the new button and then select file upload. This is for individual files photos, music, and even videos. After accessing the desktop site, you can now upload your files by pressing the new button. You will now be able to see the new button located at the top left portion of your web browser. Press that and then you will be able to upload your files. You can now select file upload or folder upload, but if you are only uploading single files, or individual files, then I suggest that you just click File Upload for that. Now, after pressing or selecting File Upload, you can now locate and select the files or folder that you want to upload. You can now upload your outputs, your activities, your projects, and other relevant files you are required to upload. Now, this is how you will locate and select the files that you want to upload as shown on the slide. Now, after choosing and selecting the files that you want to upload, go to the top right portion of your web browser and click or press select. This will allow you to upload the files that you have just selected. Okay, your files are now uploaded. You can now disable the desktop site option on your web browsers. And most importantly, you can now notify your teacher, your head, your supervisor, or anyone in particular that your files are already uploaded. Congratulations! So that's it everyone, thank you for watching and have a nice day!